welcome back to the channel guys hope you are doing extremely well and this is your very own mass code at this side in this video we are going to discuss the question or even problem so what does the problem say or even problem so what does the problem say the problem says that you have been given a string s of lower case english letters okay i am highlighting the important words find out whether the summation of x and y is even or odd where x is a count of distinct characters okay distinct characters that occupy even positions in English alphabets. It is important to see English alphabets and have even frequency. Similarly, Y is the count of distinct characters which occupy odd positions in English alphabets, right? And have odd frequency. Positive means greater than or equals to zero. Okay. So what does the question say? The question says that this is your input S equals to A triple B double C. Okay. Now if I see what is the frequency of A, it is one. What is the frequency of B? it is 3. What is the frequency of C? It is 2. Correct? Am, am I saying correct? Yeah. Now what is the uh, position of A in English alphabets? Position of A in English alphabets. So if I write down the alphabets which I know, I will say A, B, C, D, E, F all the way up till Z. So A is at position 1, B is at position 2, C is at position 3, D is at position 4, E at position 5, so F at position 6, sector, sector, and Z at position 26. Alright, so what is happening is A is at position 1 and its count is also equals to 1. See, 1 is also odd, this one is also odd. So what will I do? Y is the count of odd positions, right? So Y plus plus. Y will now become 1. X is currently 0. B equals to 3. What is the position of B? 2. 2 is even, but 3 is odd. So nothing will happen because all both of them are not matching. 2, C is equal to 2 but this position is odd, C is even, count is even but its position is odd. So again, 0, 0, 0, 0. Total Y is 1, total X is 0, 0 plus 1, right, X plus Y is 0 plus 1, that is equal to 1. Now if this summation is odd, I have to return odd. If this summation is even, I have to return even. And you can see uh, 1 is odd, that is why I am returning odd. That is why I am returning odd. Now, how will I solve this problem? See, it is an easy based problem as marked by GFG also. So, we will solve it easily. We just want the count of each character. We just want the count of each character. What do we want? We want the count of each character. Now, there are two ways for that. You can use a map. Secondly, you can use an array. Why an array? Because it has been given that all the letters are lowercase. All the letters are lowercase. That is 26 letters at max. 26 distinct letters at max. That is why I can make an array of size 26. I can make an array of size 26 to store the corresponding counts. Right? In which A will occur position 0. How will I get link A with 0? So A minus A. This int is actually equals to 0. Similarly B minus A is equals to 1. C minus A equals to 2, etc, etc, et so on and so forth, right? So what will I do? I will just traverse to the string. So I will make a vector of int, vector of int, which I, uh, int y, because I'm storing the indexes. Let us name it as count, right? Now, what will the size of it? So I want the one base indexing, right? I want the one base indexing. So instead of linking A to 0, I will be linking A to 1, right? For facilitation, right? I will make a size of 27 because I want 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 up till 26. So last index to 26. So I will make an array of 20 size, 27. And now what will I do for int i equals to 0 all the way up till s dot length minus 1. What will I do? I will say count of s i minus a. This will give me the position that is a will be linked to 0 plus 1. Now a will be linked to 1 plus plus this will increase the count at the position of that uh, array in the visited array right now i have all the counts in the count array simple i will say x equals to 0 y equals to 0 what will i do i will say for i equals to 1 to 27 now i will traverse the count array first condition is if visited of i is not equals to 0 that is the count is present and visited of i percentile 2 equals to equal to 0 even that is even position and count is also even. Oh, sorry, this is for count and this is for position. Uh, even of percentile 2 equals to equals to 0. What do we do in that case? X plus plus, right? Otherwise, the else case states else if 
v0 5 percentile 2 equals to equals to 1 and i percentile 2 equals to equals to 1 in that case y will be incremented right at last i will say if x plus y is odd return odd even then return even simple as that what is the time complexity so i am actually traversing this so o of n for this o of 27 for this and now o of 2 for this so it is actually o of n only space complexity i am using 27 size array which is constant so i will say o of 1 is my constant space right okay so it's time for you to move to the code and see it because the problem is actually not very difficult so i don't want to waste your time as well okay so let us move to the code now all right guys so here is the coding section but before starting with the code i would like to request you to please subscribe to my channel because unfortunately only 20 percent of you have subscribed and which is very disappointing because see it gives me really a lot of motivation if you subscribe to the channel okay so please give me a subscription and now you can proceed with the code so what will happen i will say int x equals to zero in the starting y equals to zero right and now i will make a count array so vector of int count size 27 initial is always zero now for int i going from zero i less than s dot length i plus plus what will happen i will say count of si minus a plus one y plus one so that we don't have to do one base indexing while traversing the count array plus plus this will give me the count now simple for int i going from one i less than equals to 26 i plus plus what will happen oh sorry i less than equal to 26 i plus plus what will happen if first condition is if vis of i is not equal to zero that is the count is there visited of i percentile 2 equals to equals to 0 even and i percentile 2 equals to equal to 0 in that case x plus plus else if visited of i percentile 2 equals to equals to 1 and y percentile 2 i percentile 2 equals to equal to that that equals to equal to 1 that means odd occurrence and odd uh, number of count right now in that case y plus plus simple now i will just say uh, sum equals to x plus y if sum percentile 2 equals to equals to 1 in that case return odd else return even it should work fine let me try it let me try to compile and run it it should work fine in the meantime do consider subscribing to the channel because it really motivates me there is some error oh it is not viz oh actually I, for, when i tried it first i used viz so that is why i mentioned viz all along let me change it not take a moments count it should work fine now it is running let us try it for submit as well it will run i guess should not give any error it is running fine 169 days streak as you can see so thank you for watching and we'll meet tomorrow with a new video with a new question till then stay tuned keep coding and don't forget to subscribe thank you have a nice day